So hello everybody and welcome to 25 days or Dark Fridays challenge. This is day one and before you get started make sure you watch the announcement video to know the details and rules and regulations and things like that. If you don't have the time at least make sure that you download my Northwind database for this challenge and then you refresh it especially with time intelligence okay. So let's get started. Day one. How many current products cost less than $20? First, let's do it with our DAX and then we do the DAX thing, okay? So the first thing that we need to do is how many current products. So we need to go to the product table, put the product name, cost less than $20. So we know here, go to the unit price, put it there. And now with the filter pane, we can actually go to unit price and say is less than 20 and it will filter by how many products and now we just need to cut the product so if we go here again and put the product name and change it to account it will tell us how many products and it says 39 here's the thing the questions say how many current current products so products that have not been discontinued yet if you know the not one data set you will see i know i tricked you a little bit there is a column called discontinued and some of these products has actually been discontinued and those are one account. So you want to have, you want to go here to discontinue and say discontinue is false. It means that there are current, there are still available. And the number that we get is 37. Okay. So the actual answer is 37 products cost less than 20 bucks that have not been discontinued. How do we do it with that? Let's do it. Okay. So I actually have a measure table. I know, don't kill me. But this is perfect, perfect for measure tables. So solutions, I'm going to create all my solutions in there. So day one, the what we need to do is to calculate where are we doing? We're counting products, right? So count of products. And then we need to filter. We need to filter this table by product the product table we need to filter where unit price is less than less than 20 and we need to also filter you could either do like that or you can do separate product where discontinued is equal to false right and now we're going to put the one in there we're going to put it as a card and then we get the solution 37 okay so that was pretty okay dax right and you can also find the answer without dax so so i will see you again tomorrow for question two day two of 25 days of dax fridays see you tomorrow <laughs>